welcome back to another video in today's video we're going to talk about what runes i'm accumulating because i believe when bitcoin is going to hit new all-time high a ton of of these people that made money off of bitcoin they're going to migrate to runes and we're going to see some of these runes they're going to perform really well not only the top 10 but also some of these runes that are already established on the market they have a decent memeability and cold in my opinion they're going to be profitable as well so quickly if we're going to take a look at coin market cap you can see the fear and greed index shows 55 which in my opinion is a great time to be accumulating you don't want to be buying let's say when the greed index is at 90 uh, so for example if you look at all time high you can see the last bull run when we had when the bitcoin price was around 60,000. after that when we were going down a ton of different meme coins were performing really well not only on solana but also on ethereum so this is where the pure gen wealth is made with uh, meme coins because you can make profit extremely fast but you can also lose your assets extremely fast so it's, it works in both ways so you have to be really careful you don't want to allocate too much funds to play with meme coins because it's going to be extremely risky so you have to have the right strategy if you want to play this game so right now if you look at magic eden you can see that we have only one rune that crossed one billion uh, market cap which is the first one of Fihu, of Ehu, um, ZZ, whatever you want to call it the second rune that is really close to one billion is don't go to the moon I believe when we're gonna have this mania this rune is going to cross 1 billion market cap really fast and it's because of the leonidas cult he was really early to the bitcoin ecosystem so he has a ton of connections and he have definitely the power to push this rune moving forward especially when we're gonna have the retail this is going to be probably the easiest way to onboard masses to ordinals and also runes and it's going to be probably the retail's first rune if they're gonna join it they're gonna buy it uh, they'll go to the moon so the reward on this rune they might be decent they're not going to be crazy because the market cap is already high but if you want to look for something that is going to make you even more profits you want to be looking at something that is going to have the lower market cap the another rune that i want to talk about today is billion dollar cut these runes are not in any order so i'm just going to show them to you which i'm, I'm holding and which i am going to buy soon you can see the volume in the past 24 hours it was just great 17 bitcoin over 1 million dollars so we have a ton of different whales that are holding definitely plus one bitcoin in billion dollar cut i found about this rune really early so you can see this sats was around five to ten sats for a while and then um it was sealed in a couple of bunch of different discords you can see now we are sitting around 80 sats I, I don't think this is the end of this run yet of this run but we might expect a short correction because we already pumped 40 percent in the past 24 hours so if you want to buy you might wait for a, for a quick dip um and it might be great opportunity if you want to uh, scoop some of these runes if you want to hold it for a long term because i think the name is really great they have the great memeability you can also check the twitter they also have a website so you can make your own memes you can see all of these memes that are already popping on twitter if you scroll down you can dra drag and drop your image and you can you know add some title to it and you'll see it's going to add these eyes to your uh, image so in this meta the memes are really important for the community for the project to sustain because if the memes are strong more people gonna more people gonna buy it more people gonna start talking about this chilling about this on on twitter youtube discord and it's gonna cause this supply shock at some point so purely is one of these runes that i'm holding at the moment and then another one i want to talk about quickly is psycho hamster so they have a really strong meme so you can see they are extremely active they work on a bunch of different things that they want to public soon you will see we have uh, different memes like for example this um note psychos and the memes are really cool so as i said before if the project has a great memes it's going to onboard more people to its community so right now we corrected from around 300 sats and the market cap is 2.5 million of course this is the risky coin so it might go straight to zero so i allocated very small percentage of my meme coins portfolio to psycho of course nothing in this video is a financial advice because some of these meme coins they might go straight to zero some of these meme coins might do 20x so you have to really diversify your portfolio because you never know which coins are going to do really well my personal strategy i'm going to hold a bunch of different coins i'm just gonna leave some moon bucks for some of these uh runes because we never know which one of these is going to do 100x uh when we're gonna hit the new all-time high and when more money is gonna flow into runes Another one that I'm bullish on is the Donald Trump. So this one also minted completely for free. You can see the market cap is really attractive because it's around $7 million. They have a decent volume of around $60,000 in the past 24 hours. And why I'm bullish on Donald Trump is because the election is coming soon. But I still think the 10x is possible and we hit around 25 subs per rune. 
And when Bitcoin is going to hit new all-time high, I think this drone has a really high chance and really good potential to shine as well. They are also very active on Twitter. They will notice a bunch of different posts. And this is the first Donald Trump rune. And on the top of that, Trump really likes Bitcoin and cryptocurrency. So when he's going to start talking about crypto and Bitcoin, Trump rune, in my opinion, definitely going to start pumping. But the other one that I want to mention is RSIG. So I'm pretty sure everyone knows about RSIG at this point. But if you had never heard about them before, they are pioneers in the space. They introduced the pre-rune as the first one. So essentially, the urge of ordinals to uh, OG diamond holders for all different collections. And these uh, ordinals, they yield you some of these runes. And that was really lucrative airdrop. So you'll see the market cap right now is 160 million. I still believe 2 to 3 to even 5x is still possible. And especially right now, we are on the nice dip. So the all time high, you can see it was almost 25 starts per rune. So right now, we are sitting around 10 to 11. So we have this support here. So right now, I believe it's a great time to be buying. Of course, non financial advice. Nothing in this video is financial advice, guys. So you have to do your own diligence and your own research. But in my opinion, R6 is one of these runes that is going to perform. Of course, they're not going to do 20 to even 50x, but 2 to 5x is definitely on the card. Another one I want to talk about is rune number two, Decentralized. So right now we are sitting in 2.5 slots per rune. And when they launch, it was 7.5 slots. And it's just weird to me that this rune is so low. It's only 35 million. We have a bunch of different runes that are much higher than rune number two. And I don't think they are done by any means. This rune is made by Cyber Kongs, which was really successful project in back in 2021 when this entire staking mechanism was introduced. So Cyber Kong was really popular and it was really expensive. Uh, the OG collection was really, really expensive. I believe it was around 100 ETH at some point. So it's just weird to me that this rune is so low. Uh, I believe when they're going to introduce something interesting like staking, maybe they're going to add some new mechanism. It's going to definitely appreciate the value. They have a ton of advisors. And with the experience, when the Bitcoin is going to start pumping, I don't think this is going to sustain at the same prices. And if you want to compare the market caps right now, 35 million is pretty much nothing. Bitcoin is so huge. And if you want to compare it to, let's say, Solana, pretty much a bunch of different meme coins that are pumping out of nowhere. They're making 10, 20 to even 100x on Solana. So rune number two, in my opinion, is super undervalued. And on the top of that, it's on Bitcoin. Another one that I want to talk about as well is Satoshi Nakamoto. So this rune is rune number six. And it did really, really well at the start. I believe it touched around $9. So, no, so right now we are sitting around $30 million. So if you believe in runes, Satoshi Nakamoto seems like an obvious bet to me. And it's also a meme. And I've seen a bunch of different conspiracies that they are working on some different things in the back end, like different collections, different runes that are going to be airdrop. I don't know whether that's true. It might be just fake and speculation. But Satoshi Nakamoto seems very, very obvious bet to me. When all of these runes are going to start pumping, Satoshi Nakamoto has a chance to do really well as well. Another meme coin is Wanko Manko runes. So if you don't know, this is from Casey's lore. And someone created that rune. They're also running a bunch of different memes. So it's not like it's empty inside because it has the entire lore and meme ability to it and the entire story. So you'll see the market cap is around 11 to 12 million dollars. We are currently at the support levels, pretty much like every single rune. So I still believe there's a ton of upside potential when runes are going to be pumping. Another one is Waddle Waddle Pengu. And this rune was created by creator of uh, Pups also. I bought this rune really early. I believe it was around three sats. Um, and they're working on a bunch of different utilities. I believe it's going to be the bridge between Bitcoin and Solana. Nothing is really confirmed. Of course, you know that good things takes time. So we might see some cool utility behind it when this is going to be launched. And especially when the product is going to be working, a ton of people are going to start buying it. And especially when the market cap is super low, I believe 10x is still possible. It's still on the cards. So it's going to be very interesting to watch it. And last but not least, I want to mention Mr. Yen, Japanese businessman. And you have to notice that this is very low market cap. So it might go straight to zero. It might do 10x. It might do 100x. We never know. They are really active on the main Twitter page. In my opinion, they make one of the best memes uh, in the rune space. As I said before, who controls the memes controls everything. So it's going to be really exciting to see how this rune is going to perform. I'm currently holding some. Not a huge bag. Very small percentage because I believe uh, there's a ton of potential on the cards. Because don't copy on this. It might go straight to zero. So we never know. So if you guys enjoyed this video, you can let me know in a comment down below. If you want to apply to my group, you can go to this post and you can find the application form where you can apply to join my Discord group. And I'll see you in the next one.